There are many, many students who want to become singers, but it's extremely rare for anyone to actually become a singer and reach the top of the game. That's why we admire an idol who is at the apex of their field. It goes without saying that if you're blessed with a good-looking face, amazing talents, and a ton of luck, and you also happen to have a clear goal, you can become the very best in K-pop much faster. The idol we're gonna explore today has walked a pretty smooth road to success thanks to the clear goal he had as a kid and his incredible talents. For those who don't know, when idols took a crack at acting back in the day, they were often blasted for their terrible acting, and people said they acted just for marketing purposes. These days, however, idols who can sing, dance, and look beautiful can also act really well. The person we are gonna explore is one of those gifted few, a top global idol who's been at the forefront of the Korean wave, an idol who is also praised for his fantastic acting skills in K-dramas and movies. In today's idol exploration, we are exploring Do kyung Su of EXO. But wait! Pop quiz! What is the name of the K-drama for which Do kyung Su won the Rookie Award as an actor? Number 1. It's okay, that's love. Number 2. Hello, monster. Number three, my annoying brother. Number four, along with the gods, the two worlds. Do you think you know the answer? Then tell us in the comment. And I'm sure you've already hit the like button, subscribed, and turned on the notification, right? We'll give a mystery box full of Dio's official merch to the winner selected randomly out of the subscribers that left the comments below. Don't know the answer? Keep watching the video and you'll find out. Do kyung Su was born on January 12, 1993 in Goyang, Gyeonggi Province. Because he's also an actor, Do kyung Su is an idol whose real name and stage name are both well known. When he acts, he goes by the name Do kyung Su, and when he's doing his thing as an idol, he goes by the name Dio, which refers to his last name Do. However, hardly any of his fans call him Dio. They usually just call him kyung Su or shorten Dio to Dio. Now Dio wanted to become a singer as a kid. By the way, can you picture him serving you at a Korean grill restaurant? Apparently he used to work at a grill restaurant that specializes in meat food because he wanted to attend a vocal academy. Dio wanted to become a singer. Luckily, when he was in high school, he participated in a Gyeonggi province youth music festival with his friends one day, and on his way back home, he was cast on the street by a person from SM Entertainment. One of Dio's closest friends at the time who went to Baekseok High School together was B2B's Im Hyun Sik. Interestingly enough, Im Hyun Sik had transferred from a school in China. He actually asked his classmates who was the best singer in his class, and everyone said Do Kyung Soo. He then approached Do Kyung Soo and said, Let's sing together, and that's how they met. Afterwards, the two started to pursue their shared dream to become singers. In high school, they went to various festivals and attended a music academy as well. Do kyung Soo is a great singer, but is also really good with his hands. The Wolf and the Pretty Girl on the cover of EXO's first major album, EXO EXO, were actually drawn by Dio himself. His father is an artist, and his mother is a hairdresser, which probably explains Dio's hand dexterity. After training for less than two years at SM, Dio made a big debut as a member of EXO in 2012 with their first EP titled Mama, but the album itself didn't gain much hype. But the next year, in 2013, the song Growl became an absolute sensation and EXO immediately became a top idol group. But with great stardom comes all kinds of scandals. In 2014, a dating rumor about Dio and Sojin of Girls' Day began to surface. The rumor started when a photo of the idols taken at a fishing place started to spread over the internet. This was the beginning of a series of speculations by fans as more evidence was found, including a photo of Dio and Sojin wearing what seemed to be matching rings, a photo of matching shoes, and many other suspicious elements. But neither Dio nor Sojin made any statements, and the rumor just died down. Meanwhile, Dio kept himself busy. Could it be that Dio was just too darn good-looking and talented to be satisfied with being just an idol? In 2014, Dio began building his acting career as actor Do kyung Soo with his first acting gig. He played the role of Han kang Woo in K-drama It's Okay, That's Love. Dio's performance in this program was well-received, and he went on to win a Rookie Award for it. In addition, Dio met actors Jo in Sung and Yi kwang Soo and became the Bangne member of what's known as Jo in Sung family. Then, in the same year, Dio entered movies with the movie Cart. He played the son of Sun Hee and was raised by critics for his wonderful performance. Plus, in 2015, critics voted him as one of the most anticipated idol-turned-actors. By the way, did you know? Dio had never taken an acting lesson before starring in Cart. 
At one point, he did take an acting lesson for a while, but he said he thought it'd be better to learn at the film set than through acting lessons. So he's been learning how to act at the film set ever since, with the help of the director. Considering how good he is, Dio might as well be an acting genius. Afterwards, he has starred in a wide range of K-dramas and movies, including Hello Monster, Pure Love, My Annoying Brother, EXO Next Door, Room Number Seven, Be Positive, Along with the Gods, The Two Worlds, Swing Kids, Along with the Gods, The Last Forty Nine Days, and One Hundred Days, My Prince. In all these various movies and programs, Dio has demonstrated his great potential and attractive qualities. But remember, Dio is not only a fantastic actor; he's also the main vocalist within EXO. As such, he has done the intro to so many songs. He even got a new nickname, Dioibu. The name Dioibu, as you can see, is the combination of Dio's nickname Dio and the Korean word for intro, which is Dioibu. Of all the 17 title tracks that have been released, he has done the intro to seven tracks. And of all the 15 winter album tracks, he's done nine intros. Every time a new song is released, Dio's vocal tone is highly praised. Now you might think, well then, if he's so good at acting and singing, his dancing skills must be lacking. Well, guess what? He might be overshadowed by Kai and Sehun, who are exceptionally good. But Dio is actually a pretty decent dancer, and is praised for his good sense of rhythm and facial expressions. And of course, if we are gonna properly explore Dio, it's impossible not to talk about how good looking he is. This is something that the rest of EXO members agree on as well. Dio is basically the face of EXO. His big, pretty eyes and heart-shaped lips, in particular, melt everyone's heart. Plus, the strong expression in his eyes, his jawline, his sharp nose, and his nicely round head shape make him a dazzling idol. When it comes to Dio's face, one thing we cannot leave out is his eyes. Due to his astigmatism, Dio tends to raise his eyes a little bit, and this often causes some misunderstanding because of how he raises his eyes in his photos. He has big eyes, but his irides are quite small, so the whites of his eyes are relatively large, which sometimes makes it look like he's glaring or in a bad mood. In fact, Chanyeol later revealed that when he first saw Dio, he talked with Suho and Kai behind Dio's back and said, "I don't like that guy." Kai confessed that when he first met Dio, he was afraid because of Dio's stares, but now it's become Dio's trademark, and fans absolutely adore him for it. So yes, he's got the look and he's got the skills for an excellent K-pop idol. But what about his personality? At one time, Dio used to worry his fans. In his very first interview on Inki Kayo since making a debut as an EXO K member, he was so nervous that when he tried to say "magnificent orchestra," he said "the superior orchestra." He was so embarrassed, and the host quickly jumped in to help him out. But this experience was quite traumatic for Dio. There was a rumor that Dio's previously cheerful personality had become timid and gloomy from this experience. In an interview, Dio actually said it himself that it was traumatic, and he also mentioned that he had been heartbroken when he had messed up something he had perfectly prepared for during a rehearsal. Dio said he's become more worried about meeting everyone's expectations ever since. But he also said he will probably never see a day when he's free from the pressure, which seems to indicate that he's a perfectionist too. Unlike what you would presume from his sedate personality, EXO members once explained in an interview that Dio is the quiet cutie of EXO. It's because he usually seems somewhat quiet and manly, but then every once in a while he would do something unexpected, which everyone else finds extremely cute. It's why fans also call Dio Almo Gyeong, a Korean abbreviation that means Gyeongsu, who I thought I knew but didn't. Dio is thoughtful and takes good care of people around him too. Anyone and everyone who has met him absolutely loves him and has nothing but good things to say about him. Dio is also the official chef within EXO. On his day off, he cooks for his teammates and managers. Sometimes the teammates or managers post photos of Dio's dishes on social media. Apparently, when Dio finds a menu he is interested in, he learns how to cook it from his mother or finds the recipe on the internet and tries to cook it himself. You can actually watch Dio cooking in the video called "Home Cooking with Chef Dio" on EXO's V Live channel, and it seems that Dio's cooking skills will improve even more as he is currently a military cook in the army. That being the case, it makes one wonder which celebrities is Do Gyeongsu the ultimate sweet guy friends with. 
Dio has quite a wide network of connections thanks to his warm personality. He is especially close with the members of Cho in sung family. They hang out, have some delicious food, and travel around together as well. Actors Cho in sung Kim Gi-bang, Lee Gwang-soo, and Kim Woo-bin were actually spotted multiple times in EXO's concert in Korea and Japan. They also post Dio's photos on social media to congratulate him on special occasions, such as his birthday, his movie premiere, or when EXO won the first place on a music program. Because of his busy schedule as an actor slash singer, there once was a rumor that Dio would leave EXO and become a full-time actor. Be that as it may, Dio cares about his activities as an EXO member more than anyone. Even when sometimes he had to juggle his work as an actor and his work as an idol at the same time, he almost always participated in EXO's promotional activities. Dio would put his EXO schedule above his acting schedule whenever they overlapped. So it's really unlikely that Dio will ever leave EXO to pursue acting. Since Dio is busy fulfilling his military obligations at the moment, we'll have to wait a little longer until we get to see him again. The wait is painful for sure, but we all know that when Dio finally steps back into the K-pop scene, it'll be a beautiful comeback like no other. Thanks so much for watching today's video. Please hit the like button and subscribe. If there's any K-pop star you want to know more about, tell us in the comment. For the selected topic, we'll put together a big giveaway event. This has been Tuyuram's Idol Exploration. See ya!